The local man accused of killing an innocent bystander in a barroom shooting is found guilty. It took jurors about three hours tonight to convict 39-year-old De'Eric Bell on all three charges he faced. As News 13's Courtney Fegley tells us the jurors did not buy Bell's self-defense argument. We, the jury, find the defendant guilty of manslaughter, but lesser included offense. Not only did the jury find De'Eric Bell guilty of manslaughter, but also guilty of attempted second degree murder and of being a convicted felon in possession of a firearm. On September 3rd, 2021, Bell got into a fight with 27 year old LaQuentin Williams inside of the Outrigger Lounge. Bell allegedly hit Williams' girlfriend, so William hit Bell once in the face. When he swung a second time, Bell ducked, pulled a gun, and fired two shots. Both missed. Williams, but one hit 55 year old Tracy Ekman, a patron who was playing darts nearby. Ekman was killed. Bell fled with Williams right behind him. Once they were in the parking lot, Williams pulled his own gun and fired at Bell, but missed. At trial, the defense claimed Bell was acting in self defense and that he only fired one shot inside the bar. The investigator found the casing several feet away from where the whole thing happened, and she said that, ca that casing was retrieved put in evidence and identified as a 40 count. But prosecutors tried to keep the jury focused on the fact that Bell fired the shot that killed an innocent man. The death was caused by the criminal act of De'Eric Bell. And again, I don't think that that is dis disputed in this case at all. Uh, you saw the video. Mr. Ekman was killed because this defendant, De'Eric Bell, pulled that firearm, pulled that trigger, and shot him. At one point during Wednesday night's deliberations, the jury said one of their members was sick and they requested to break for the night. The defense agreed, but prosecutors asked the judge to urge the group to continue, which they did. Because of his extensive criminal record, Bell faces a possible life sentence. In Panama City, Courtney Fegley, News 13, Panhandle Strong. The deliberations were delayed this afternoon because the judge's computer didn't work properly. There was about a two hour delay. In January, Williams pled no contest to aggravated assault with a firearm and is serving five years. Bell will be sentenced on May the 15th.